Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Jay Spike Gaming, back again, for, and really, I mean, really back again uh, for Final Fantasy 16 demo. I've, I'm sorry, I've been out a while. I was dealing with some stuff back in, actually, stuff from COVID to floods to get to a new house. So yeah, it's been a wild ride. I haven't been posting much lately. I haven't done none of that, but now I'm back again to post to post more and you know keep going. You know, building my channel up, building my channel up. So so I would like I would like you guys to support. It'd be a pr most appreciated. You know, like, subscribe, click the bell on notification so. You, so that way you'd be alert for more of my videos. For now, so now we're playing Final Fantasy 16, the demo. Uh, I played it already, and not gonna lie, I was not disappointed. I actually liked the gameplay. And the gameplay, the story is crazy. So I'm gonna do so I'm gonna do it again and see the, uh, what little things I can find. Well, thanks, um, the yeah, what the hell is a Moss Color? Or where is that? You know, I play a lot of Final Fantasy <laughs> games. But I don't know, this one was pretty different. Like, well, most bloody and gory. At that point, too, that it's an M rated game and shit. <laughs> Which is actually awesome, but crazy. Because. Since since, uh, since Final Fantasy is technically not kind of like not that, that kind of game, but at the same time it does have its own differences too. And now we're facing a Phoenix and if an Ifrit. <laughs> I'm not like the summons in this game are really cool. Like Phoenix looks awesome. Ifrit looks like a badass. Whoa. That's what I'm talking about. Like, the graphics in this game is. Like, it's like watching a movie. <laughs> but without the movie. Without actually being a movie. Alright, let's begin. Firebolt. Okay. Right now, we're in, like, just the prologue. And the demo only covers, like. At, like, I think at one of the game so I don't know oh my gosh yeah yes I'm gonna make mistakes okay I'm only human so um yeah um as I've seen as much of the game that um you know it isn't too crazy to understand but, but it's also pretty awesome when you see a bunch of um, plot twists and everything. Um, not like that, but I can't. But honestly, I can't wait for this game to come out. I'm definitely gonna be recording more of the game when it comes out. Oh, I think that's gonna be my primary focus. And then I'm gonna go between 16 and. Five Fantasy Seven Remake because of Rebirth. So that's gonna so that so everyone make sure to uh, oh um look forward for that okay the Nisa D file something for public I don't know actually I wanted to know like wait year was this that's the only thing. Okay, so we got our, you know, characters. We got, uh... I don't know. I don't know who these guys are. But our main character is Clive. Just sitting there, chilling. Okay. I got a question. What, is the, what does they mean by dominant, though? Ouch. Sorry. 
you know? Because they call it the summons icons, but what is a dominant? Is it like a vessel of the summon? Or, you know? Let's get this done. Yes, we shall get this done. So, yeah. I can't. I can't wait for. I did see um Final Fantasy Nine, um remake, and that looked really nice. And I've played Nine. I just have a tendency. You know, I have a, just have a tendency not to play them you know, again over, you know, like a hundred times. I don't know why. And I do like. I do like the series. Do like the game. Uh, eventually I will be playing regular Nine. For you guys, so you know, look for so I look forward to that. But I'm mostly looking forward to play 16. To be honest, Focus, it's all it's awesome. It's a lot of detail on characters, landscapes, even the monsters themselves. Yes, all right, so now we are beginning the game. Like, look at I this. I'm focusing, hold on. And like, look at that sun. That sun's beautiful. Like, they put, Square Enix put very a lot of detail on this game. And to be honest, I never get disappointed them. I never get disappointed for it. Okay, so pressing, well, pressing where the hell, the start button. Anytime would be the main menu. And also gameplay configurations. Yeah, we know. Everyone knows about gameplay configurations. Uh, you know, making the game look brighter, make, you know, alright, let's go, make the game looking brighter and everything, so I'm not going to go into detail that, everyone knows what that is. Just in time. Mm. Oh, yay, oh, we're, we're watching, oh, war, oh, shit, that's, that war's breaking out fast. See, things like this you don't oh, really see though. Look at that. Blood on an axe. Using magic. Like, Square really went at, went to a whole different side. But it, to the point, like, you know, it goes based on story, gameplay. But this goes beyond gameplay. It also goes like. Up, oh, down, down, down. Dead, dead, dead. Like blood, you know, because when I first played this, I saw blood. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> they really took a whole different turn. But also, I'm really excited too. <laughs> and yeah, they're still going to use it. Use it. Now. One thing they I know about war is that they always use their be best weapon for last. <laughs> Clamps like I will kill I'm gonna kill that I'm gonna go to a stronghold and kill who and kill whoever. What do you mean you refuse? Uh pretty much he said I don't wanna fight anymore. Ooh. Someone's getting a little Hasty there. Marshal, the king of Walud is our guest. I got dudes, king. <laughs> it doesn't look like you. Have his Majesty's answer. I don't know, but that like guy throw me off. He doesn't say much. <laughs> Yo, they made crystal into a wa- they, they use a water crystal to make water, that's crazy. Like, they really are dependent on magic. Night Lash is kinda hot though. <laughs> but, also kinda threatening at the same time. That you summoned us at all. Have you so little faith in your own men? It was the Dalmex who drove back the Crusaders in the Battle of the Twin Worlds, was it not? Or am I mistaken? 
Besides, your dominant has yet to take the field. Yeah, it's gotta be like a vessel then. Underestimate them. Bugger their knights. What did you say? Should this citadel be allowed to fall? The capital will lie exposed. Mm hmm. That's interesting. The crusaders will wait for the good king's pawns to line up before taking to the board. Ugh, bad breath. <laughs> Which just leaves me. Yeah, for most bru for a lot of brutes in Final Fantasy games, this guy is way too damn cocky. she's gonna follow him hey come back lover you cock <laughs> and that's another thing they say a lot of swear words in this game I'm, I'm like what what if this is a final fantasy game <laughs> but then again they do the same thing with seven so I don't think it really matters Uh, sorry guys, a lot of things are happening upstairs, like ma I'm having maintenance in the house, and I have four dogs I have to bark. So hopefully you guys can hear, if any, you can't, well actually, I don't think there's no can, if you can, as long as you can hear it, I think you'll be fine. <laughs> Does Clive even have a choice of being there? Wait, let's jump. Let's roll now. I'm not gonna lie, you gotta dig the armor though. That looks really cool. Like, super cool. All right, let's go and see what's going on. Yeah, I cannot get enough how, how amazing this game was game is right now game is right now like come on oh damn it
All right, sorry about that, guys. I had to do something real quick. Take the van. <clears throat> well, yeah. And it's been a it's been a while since I last record. I had a lot I had a lot of things that was happening happening. First, I was thinking like, am I even good? In, am I even good enough to even record or make content? Because that's the thing I always have, always had trouble with. Like. I can record games. I might, you know, use for my own thoughts or opinions about them, and play about play my own game, play my own gameplay. But at the same time, but at the same time, that you know, I'm also doing commentary. But you know, sometimes I'm like, I don't know what to say, or you know, think of things to say. So usually I just let the gameplay itself, and then I just, you know, comment. Comment over, do commentary over the, my game, well, over the gameplay. Okay, right, you know, okay. But now I'm gonna be fully dedicated to you know, building my channel up. Okay, tell me that does not look like Loom Freya from Final Fantasy 15. I, when I first, cause when I first saw Shiva the first time, I'm like, isn't it Loom Freya? Oh, they just copied it. And they got Titan being a huge monster. Like, damn. Compared to Shiva, look at him. Okay, who will win a fight? I don't know. Comments below Shiva or Titan. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, Titan looks pretty ugly. <laughs> I don't want it look I mean I say he's made of like earth and everything. But at the same time he looks like like a um one of those mutant ones from Resident the Resident Evil series. Okay, at that point he got you. He was like, looks like he was really fast doing that. Okay, don't tell me when I get to die and don't get to die. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, let's go. <clears throat> I'm going. I'm going. Like, damn. Oh, oh, I'm sliding down. Yeah, cause things going, things getting hectic. <laughs> Let's go. Let's run, 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 run. You telling me? Oh, oh shit! Oh, you give me a break! I'm trying here. Oh crap! Up, jump, go up. Ah, we made it. Okay. Oh, never mind. Yes. Okay, so you want me to jump that? That is suicide. But it's a Final Fantasy game, so nothing is, you know, impossible. But I mean, uh, but I did have some ideas uh, for the channel actually. I was thinking of doing, you know, like old, like old, like retro games, like like right the nineties era, era, everything. Um, I want to do something. Don't want to. Do, also, I was thinking of my Nintendo Switch, but I have to look up something to record that because I've been mostly recording through my PS5. Well, first was PS4, now PS5. Don't tell me how to live my life. <laughs> I'll live if I want to kill myself. I'll kill myself. Brother. Oh, he's gone. All right. Now we're heading back to the past. 
Oh well, he saw his future self. He's like, what the hell happened to my future self? <laughs> Okay, so they don't, okay, so they don't even tell you that they don't even tell you the year of his grown up self, but so it has it gotta be like maybe at least seven years, maybe ten years at most. Unless of course you think you can defend your master while sat on your ass in a puddle of pig swill. I'm sure he'd find a way. Okay, you know he's that was rude. Joshua you're sure to hit him eventually. I ain't playing it up. Oh, look at the little doggy. Yeah, I like, I like the little doggy. He's so, he's so cute. All right then, let's go. Two arms. Two arms. Oh come on, I'm gonna kick your ass so hard that you're gonna go to another planet. Or right, back to the icons. All right, time for gameplay. Okay, well. Okay, for the sake of, you know, everyone else who hasn't tried this game yet, I'm going to go through the combat training. Let's start again from the beginning. Okay, cool. Show me your form. Attack the low commander. Melee, you know, press square to perform a melee attack. Up to four times can be chained together. Okay. Now watch me kick his ass. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Nope. Okay, you just blocked it. Very good. Such swordsmanship will serve you well in the field. But can the same be said of your spellcraft? The flames of the phoenix burn within you. Now let them burn without. Oh yeah. Okay. You know what? I will. After it tells me, channel your inner flame. Okay, press score, press triangle to cast fire and range spell that can strike enemies from a great distance. Okay. Fire! 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 Burn, bitch! Burn! You know, I thought when I first saw so I was like, okay. Because in trailers, you see you call upon Ifrit, right? But he's supposed to be a bearer of the Phoenix, so I'm thinking like, okay, so was he? The, so is he the Phoenix? And somehow he went down to an evil path to get Ifrit. See that? that I didn't understand. I was like, okay, that because he can use the Phoenix power, but. Oh shit, okay, evading, oh, okay, this is where I hate them, this is where it's hard the most, cause, to really, f um, dodge them, so you gotta, fuck, huh. ah. so pretty much, with evading, you gotta hit in the last moment, say, I'm trying to read, okay, Let's see, Let's see, yeah, do it like in the last second. I was sure I had you. That was amazing. So you gotta do it like a lot. So you probably you gotta do it in the last second to do a precision dodge and then Remember strike him down. Your blade is not your only weapon. Yeah, no shit, I know that. Of foot are indispensable arms in any shield's arsenal. Got it. <laughs> you are not just any shield, are you? Show me what sets you apart. I was saying, oh yeah, about the. <laughs> Yeah, I, yeah, I think I. Age. Yeah. Granted the use of its power. See, that's the thing. Call upon that I'm thinking like that. I'm because I'm think because when I first saw it, well, they don't and when I saw, play the demo, they tell you about oh he has the power to a fe a phoenix, right? But it's, it's like okay, so we see him when he's young. He's like oh yeah, I got the power to phoenix. I am amazing now. But. Then you see that um he gets in the trailers, you see him get you know, calling upon Ifrit. So I'm thinking to myself, okay, so at first he was young, ambitious, a lot of um, hope, then you feel like and then you feel more when you see him older, he's like, Okay, I'm in the I'm in the dark side now. And I won't just wanna kill somebody, you know, what so I was like, what led to that? Anyway, okay. Iconic feats. 
the blessing of the Phoenix Grants Clive the ability to perform feats of inhuman strength and dexterity. Phoenix Ship is one of the such one of such iconic feet. Press circle to swiftly close in on the distant targets. Both medium range attacks magic, which is range attack, can be used while executing a Phoenix shift. So pretty much what Phoenix works, you press circle. Like he like he just moves a lot faster. So that could be useful actually, don't think about it. Oh, I could make a challenge run so just using um, the Phoenix Shift only. If your wounds mended and your energies That'd be actually cool. Speaking of which, my lord, yes. A worse for wear. Now that won't do at all. What do you mean? Mend your wounds. Oh, okay. Yeah, use a potion. Okay, so pretty much how potions work, you gotta use the D pads. So consumable items such as potions and tonics can be used to restore Clive's HP or terminate give him a boost. And you have to use the D pads to consume them. But you go go to menu menu, you can really um you can switch it up to your liking. Well, I, I just choose to use up because it makes it easier. Oh. Alright, I gotta use a lot of them. Oh, okay, fine, cool. That's better. Tell you, I could just use high potion and got it all worth it. But if I do not, and yes, I do speak backwards. Uh, I have been told a bunch of times. So do with the information you want. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not, I'm not much of a good speaker. That's why, you know, I can see. Now I'm getting it why people, like other YouTubers, do scripts so they can memorize it, what they're going to say before saying it. But I feel like I write just speak my mind. I have to speak my mind instead of trying to, you know, think about it. I'm not, because I, like, I don't like thinking about it. I like just going to it. All right, final battle. Let's go kick his ass now. By no lesson. Defeat Lord Commander. Okay, now this is different. Breaking the opponent's will. The will gauge indicates on opponent's will to f will to fight. Fight back. Break their spirit rate by landing tags and strike them when they are vulnerable. So pretty much um, a stagger bar from Final Fantasy 13. You provide cut. So for, for anyone that has not played that, probably majority you did. There's always a stagger bar, and the higher the stagger gauge is, the faster it become, the faster your bo the boss become, boss or enemy becomes staggered. It's the same thing. The only actually, yeah, same thing. The only thing is you're breaking it down. So like actually, Strangers of Paradise, which I will be covering that game too. I might just go a whole Final Fan, a whole Final Fantasy for June and July. So. Oh, what the fuck? That's what the. Oh wait, wait, wait. Am I pressing the wrong button? Oh wait, I'm stupid. I'm pressing L, L1, it's the R1. Yeah, ha! And then uh, fight. Oh damn it. Precision attack. Uh, shift. Uh. Yeah. So pretty much, you do more dan. I believe you do more damage. When, oh, oh, yo, I'm, yo, come on, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna lie, I have, I do not do good with evading. I'm getting used, I'm getting used to evading though. Okay, Lord Mordok's will has been broken, leaving him staggered. Try dealing as much damage as you can before he regains his senses. Okay, use R2 and Square to execute flame. Rising Flames, a powerful iconic ability granted Clive by the Blessing of the Pigs. So, I would say pretty much a limit break. R2, square, boom. 
Uh, just imagine there. Oh, go ahead. Oh. I went. Damn, I want to finish him with an ult. Oh, yes! I finished him with a bit. Yep, I got him in a bit to finish. That's what I want to do. I love this new V3 music. It's so awesome. It makes me. It reminds me of Final Fantasy XIV, which is awesome. But I haven't played it in a while. So it kind of sucks. <laughs> so that's, that's like one game I love to play. Oh. Yes, you have invested. It's taken me long enough. Yeah. That was a display worthy of your father. Thank you. You are a true shield of the flame. Let no one tell you otherwise. Okay, no problem. Me. No problem. I will let you know that. Back to your drills. Yeah, you lot. Gogging like some kind of little children. Yeah, you definitely know he's tired. <laughs> Damn, that took it out, a lot out of him. Then we meet another protagonist, Joshua. <laughs> Clive's little brother. And that's why you shouldn't. That is more than just a cold. Back. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, probably her and Clive will get it's gonna get together somehow, I don't know. So Gladly brave hell itself to see my darling boy. See how she said boy, but not boys. Gentlemen, Rosaria thanks you for your indefatigable loyalty. Not gonna lie. Thank you. Your grace. We live this bitch right here, I hate her. For this particular reason. Joshua. You should not be out of doors. We have discussed this. I'm sorry. Good day to you, mother. Because when Clive said, you know, how you doing, she just looked at him. Like, it was such disgrace. I'm like, yo, why are you being like that? <laughs> and now uh, I see why Joshua, you know, gripped his fist. You can tell Joshua loves his big brother. No matter what. To treat your own flesh and blood. I know. It's not his fault. Not everyone can be born a phoenix. Exactly. That's why I think those guys are those guys are real NPCs. We should join them. Because they're right. <laughs> yes. Clive was n Clive was not chosen to be the Phoenix. His little brother was. He still gained the power. It's just that he can't. Be, he cannot become a full phoenix, and which like really sucks, because no mom should treat their son like that. But that's why I like their father. I'm not gonna lie, he looks like Noctis. If Noctis was reincarnated. If Nice was reincarnated. Rise, my friends. Rise, the Empire. Thank you, Joshua. You 
well, well, I trust. Yes, father. Much better. The blame. June and I went to the bay to watch Clive spa. <laughs> Is that so? And this little buddy. Yes. Dog's name is Torgal, which I like. He's so cute. <laughs> he, uh, he's so cute. I'm not gonna lie. I, I would love to have a dog like that. Hey! The capital rejoices at your safe return. It's weird how Clive has to be, you know. I like how Clive had, you know, respects his father and call him, you know, your grace, you know. But when it comes, you know, it has to be from people. But he, but he does love his father. He does love his son and and really respects him. Which I, which I like about the Archduke. Oh, sorry. Yeah, he is an Archduke. But he's awesome. And here comes Torg again. But look, it's a pretty little butterfly. Aww. It sucks. <laughs> Touch the butterfly. Clive here is off to see the Archduke. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> see, I spoil your shit before I do anything. Oh well. Can't do anything about it. Sunrise, sunset. Should we chapter one? Finding your way. Should you find yourself lost? Do not fret. Hold down. What was it? L3. And tr well, what if I lost it? R3, technically. Is, you know, just pushing it down. I don't know why I made it like that, though. That's kind of stupid. And trusting your animal instincts. To, okay, to, point, to point you in the right direction. Your current... Um, destination. Dang, I can't talk today. What is wrong? Your current destination will be displayed with a. I have no idea what that is. We just know it's a marker. I'm not sure. I need to okay. Speak so let's look around because you can find items. So it could be, which will be in the item menu. That's in, in the main menu. You can look through all your items. I gotta change the remotes. So we got a potion. Nice. Wait. Actually, can I go up here? Cause I did see something. Oh, see, look at that. I see that, but I don't know how to get there. Snowy. Hmm. Uh, Shh. Yeah, see how you're supposed to get. How the hell are you supposed to get through? Wait a minute. Never mind, I found a way. <laughs> Let's go here. Yeah, I just went. I didn't even really check much. I just went through the game. I just went through it. To see how it is. I don't think it's much in the um, courtyard anyway. Good as new. Forgive me, Lord Marquess Bay. Do not concern yourself with this bungling car. Oh, damn, you fool. Yeah. I swear, back then they just like rub it. Yeah, good as new. What the fuck? No, that's bacteria. That's he's really putting on boil of them. It was no trouble, really. Oh, do not indulge him. To be allowed to stand in your lordship's presence is more than his kind deserves. Why? Neither the Empire nor the Republic treat their. I wonder how it would be to go back to dark age, like to back to the Middle Ages, like this. Very lucky, as I remind him every day. Stand, please. See, Clap is way too nice, <laughs> but that's what I like about him. He, you know, he's not. He's nice, and you know he doesn't. He just wants everyone to respect him how he is. Of course, if that is your lordship's wish. Don't work too hard. Remember, it is for the good of the duchy that you serve. He's very. I like Clive. He, 
and he's already hospital. Hospital. He would have made a fine Archduke. <laughs> Damn it, I thought I could jump it. What is this actually? Oh! There's a crystal in here. Oh, okay, I thought. The crystal was giving it water. Oh, okay. I never knew that. I just looked at it and I'm like, oh, it's so glowy. <laughs> Alright, let's go to uh, the gardens. Yes, it's of a flower and everything. Joshua, what's wrong? Clive? Why? Are you worried about the war? The soldiers will expect the Phoenix to help them, but I don't know if I can. Don't worry, Joshua. Father will guide you. And I will protect you. Always. Oh, really? Always? Oh, Clive. See, Clive's just too... He's too good of a big brother. Do you understand? The power of the Phoenix dwells within Joshua, and Joshua alone. If any ill should befall him, it will be on your head. Do not neglect your duties again. Yes, Your Grace. <laughs> Two years I thought she was talking to me, but I thought I was like, no, she's talking to her, her little servants. Okay, so large gates and stiff levers require extra effort to operate. So use X to access them, then hold R2 to push or pull. Oh, oh, come on, really? What the? Ah, oh, there you go. Should just hold it. Ladies, men. <sighs> Good luck. Thanks. Ah, oh, it's okay, little guy. I'll be back. You take like a little BB. <laughs> Carry him like a little baby. See? Kids. <gasps> See, dog eats our kids. Because <laughs> they don't listen. <laughs> My presence, Your oh Grace. How may I serve you? All right, you can stop licking my boots. My mother isn't here. <laughs> of course, <laughs> always gotta be the mom. Territories fare any better. All right, all right, you can stop licking my boots. Most <laughs> lie under a pall of black. In just these few moons, the blight has taken nigh on all of the northern reaches. It is only a matter of time before it crosses the border. Mm -hmm. Nearly every available bank of capital is already occupied by those fleeing the Deadlands. Even if we were to send them south to Port Isolde, more would only follow in their wake. Every day we delay brings us closer to disaster. We must move now. Against the Iron Kingdom. We have traded blows with them for too long. It is time to end it. At the very least, we must secure Drake's breath. Without the blessing of the Mother Crystal, we cannot defend our realm from the spread of the Blight. The Iron Blood will not relinquish it easily. 
This will be a bitter fight. We ride for Phoenix Gate tomorrow. There we will listen to the words of our ancestors, as tradition dictates. Am I to go with you as Joshua Shield? There is something else I would have you do first. Oh, like what? You will have heard the reports, I am sure, of beastmen from the north being sighted within our borders. Goblins in the Stillwind Marshes. I know of the rumors, yes. Then you know what must be done. Sorry guys, but they're doing, building up, they're making floors upstairs, so you're gonna have to bear with me. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. For real? Like, she just looks down on him, that's what I hate about her. No mother should understand that if the father looks down on his son, fine. But the mom should always be supportive. I don't know, you know? That will be all. Rest well. We ride at dawn. Yes, your grace. I would just say at the point, good night, father. Alright. Okay. Active Time Lord. This is new. You hold the pad, the middle pad down to access the t Active Time Lore. Feature a compilation of important information relevant to Clyde's current storyline progression. ATL can e even be viewed during most cutscenes. All ATL entries can be accessed later in the game. So pretty much. Oh, damn it. Can I? Oh, right, I gotta hold it. I forgot. So yeah, they just give you bits and pieces of information. The grant for the Grand Duchy of Rosaria, Edwin Rossfield, Archduke, Archduke. I um I'm not gonna really care for this that much, but it's some good information that you we can see. If anyone, if you guys like, would like to read it, you can. I don't mind. For me, I'm not gonna read it. I am more interested in the gameplay and the story. So let's head to bed. I think that's what that's what I like. I like the game. I always like the gameplay and always the, and the story. Every other. Every other little presentation, it's fun, but it's, it just ta it just takes long, and I just want to get straight to, into you know mostly gameplays and stuff. <sighs> okay, yeah. okay, we have another scene here. Ah, oh, look, it's the bitch in the royal dress. This <laughs> time, not long. Four days, maybe five. And you will be taking Joshua. Well, I can't exactly leave him behind, can I? The blood of the Rosfields runs in his veins. Before going to war, we perform the rite at Phoenix Gate. It's our way. You know that. Only the dominant can enter the apodotry, so yes, I'm taking Joshua. Oh, to hell with your way! The boy is ill. You think I don't know that? But the boy is also the phoenix, the heir to the throne. You can't mm. keep him in swaddling clothes all of his life. Elwyn! Don't worry. Clive will watch over him. He is a youth of fifteen years. He's already a fine soldier. Wow. Like a splendid ship. Wait, he's fifteen? You see more in him than the Phoenix did. He was rejected, Elwyn. Our household has no place for such a failure. He is worthless. A man like any other. And that's why I hate her. As am I, my dear. 
<laughs> Nonsense. You are the Archduke of Rosaria. Oh, not this again. See, that's why I hate her. You know as well as I do that I only sit upon the throne because my father was taken before his time. I am merely warming the seat till Joshua comes to age. You are your father's first born son. And you sit upon the throne. All is in its right place. No. That's you a gold digger. You have not disgraced our noble blood. Without men like Clive to keep us safe, your precious noble blood would long since have graced the gutter. Damn right. Tell her to straight. You the man. You have an early start. I'm going to sleep. That's why I hear because she may, she may look quite like worthless, like a failure. Like he's not a failure. Okay, he's strong. You just gotta, you know, give him a chance. This is it then. Time to prove yourself. Wishing on a star. I'm a little old for that. I should get some sleep. Right. Going with them tomorrow, aren't you? I am Joshua's shield. I'm sworn to protect him. He takes too many risks. I only wish I could save him from himself. What? I do want to know how did Joshua get ill in the first place? I have another mission too. Father has given me my first command. Well, if you're not going to pray to Metia for your safe return, I shall just have to do it for you. I feel like this girl has a crush on Clive. But I, look, I feel like her and Joshua are the same age. I mean, Clive is taller. I mean, they're both the same age. I mean, yeah, I think because Clive is taller. There's going to be another war, isn't there? You know, she does sound like Zelda from here, from um, Tears of the Kingdom. He's a fine warrior. It's getting cold. Hmm. We should go in. My lady. I feel like a problem. They. Oh, okay. Yeah. It sounds like kind of a, 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 a plan or something. I'm not gonna lie, there's a lot of cutscenes in this. Phoenix 
Phoenix Gate. May the blessing of the crystals go with us and shield the fireless flame forevermore. Yeah! Yeah! Open the gates. Yeah, open the gates so we can all die. He's such an awesome guy. And these are my two companions. We're ready to depart, my lord. They look too much of a fanboy. Die, I know. Right? <laughs> all right, got it. Oh, sorry. oh shit. World map. The world map displays all the locations. Go currently available to Clive. But you can get trapped fast travel. All right, guys. That's gonna be it for part one of Final Fantasy 16. Um, I will be doing, I will be continuing this until the game comes out. Well, maybe just three, maybe just three, three videos, because I actually want to do the icon challenges too. So, I'm, so we're going to, so what I'm going to do is finish, um, the story in part two, and then part, and then I'm going to do an extra video for the icon challenges. So this is Jay Spike signing off and have a wonderful day guys.